What's up, this is Jake with Hike 734, hiking with my wife Kristen to Hermitage Point and picking up Heron Pond and Swan Lake along the way. And the trail starts out over by the Coulter Bay Marina and uh, just travels along this beautiful little marina inside of the bay. And then um, we followed along the shores and it just kind of has a filtered view. It looks like an, on an old road. Eventually it just kind of opens up and you just get some really cool views of Mount Moran and some of the other uh, mountains along the, the ridge line there. And then you come to a junction, which to the left goes to Swan Lake, and we stayed to the right because we wanted to do it counterclockwise. And uh, you just start heading more into trees and you follow along just a finger of Coulter Bay. And eventually the trail comes and you join where the horse concessionaires use that trail. So just be aware that some sections of this um, hike have that. and. Um, to the right, it goes up to Jackson Lake Overlook, which doesn't really overlook the lake. Kristen went up there and just took a picture. And I went through the main people trail. It's a nice little traveling right through the, the open airy forest. And uh, eventually those trails merge back again at Heron Pond. And Heron Pond is a really pretty little pond that's got a bunch of lily pads. And as you follow it along, it eventually comes out to a really great overlook. And man, you can see the Tetons and it's just super beautiful. And we um, stopped there for a little bit, took a few pictures, and then continued on where it wraps around the far end of the pond. And you just get to look really deep um, out there. And then eventually we came out to um, kind of just little tiny fingers of Half Moon Bay over there. And then the trail eventually from there just kind of dives right into uh, Hermitage Point, or at least the peninsula for that. And then we just spent a lot of time at that point just gently going up and down through the trees. And uh, that just worked its way along till, I don't know, for a couple miles. And eventually we ended up coming out to the um, along the lake and you still really don't get to see the lake really great It's just kind of filtered views there and then you'll kind of go back into the trees and Then you'll see a little bit of the lake until you really get close to just the narrow little peninsula of Hermitage Point and then it just opens up really amazing and it's just such a great place to just hang out and have a bite to eat and just enjoy the mountains and uh, definitely a lot of boaters going all across the lake in the middle of summer here but anyways from there it wraps back around and you can definitely tell that this other side is south facing ridge a lot drier more sagebrush meadows and you're looking out to uh, Donahoe Point and just uh, it was really cool we saw um, these three pelicans fighting over a fish and one of them eventually gobbled it down so that was really cool to see three white pelicans out there and uh, anyways just spent a lot of time kind of going up and down some more little fingers of ridges and um, sagebrush meadows and eventually found one sagebrush meadow that the trail just works its way up a valley and uh, with a, just a little ducking in and out of trees but for the most part it's sagebrush meadows and then got into some trees and then went over by Third Creek that just slowly meanders and it's got some beaver ponds on it and just real slow moving and uh, just we're looking for some moose, but we didn't see any. And then past that, it just goes into some trees again, and then we meet up with a trail junction to start working our way back. And that's when we went ahead and we made a left and started working our way steeply up a hill. And even though Swan Lake is near you, you can't see it. And finally, it ends up working its way down to Heron Pond again, which is where you were just a little bit ago. But that junction has a couple of trails coming into it. And so from there at the junction, just stay right. And then you'll start um, climbing up a hill. And uh, eventually, you'll come right along the shores of Swan Lake. And it's a really, really long, long lake. It's got a bunch of sections of lily pads and uh, you don't come to it for a little bit and then eventually it pops you right out onto a beautiful just um, panoramic view of the area and uh, bring your binoculars and there's lots of waterfowl in there. We saw quite a few different species. So that was really uh, pretty sweet to see all those. And um, anyways, from there just kind of worked our way along and eventually, and it leaves it leaves the lake for just a little bit and then it comes alongside of it towards the far end of it and then eventually the trail just uh, comes through some more trees and then drops back down onto the same trail that at least we came in on so anyways it's a really cool loop that gets to visit um, lots of different types of bodies of water. It does spend quite a bit of time in the trees, but overall it's a pretty level trail. Um, you do have some elevation change, but nothing crazy. So anyways, this is Jake hiking with Kristen. 
to Hermitage Point and visiting Heron Pond and Swan Lake along the way in Grand Teton National Park. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe on YouTube and head on over to hike734.com for more goodness.